What's happening guys? It's been a while. It's been a while since I'm a van camp. So we're, um, as the thumbnail suggests, we're on Layby Stealth Camp number six. Um, I'll give you a better look around to, to show you. Exciting Layby. Okay, I'll just give you a bit of a pan round just on the tripod, not take these off it. We'll get a better look later on when the traffic dies down, we'll go out for a walk. Or if it, if it doesn't die down, before we go to bed, we'll go to um, we'll up in the morning and go for a walk. But as you can see, the lay by in all its glory. So that'll probably give it away for the locals who have seen that and they're passing. Yeah, it's a very busy A road. And we are going to spend the night here. And of course, a car had to pull up right behind me. So I can't put my lights on now, for goodness sake. I, r I purposely s left myself sitting back in the lay-by so they'd pull on in front of me. And I haven't got my curtain pulled this across either, so I don't know if you can see me or not. Okay, that's the curtain up. The rear window, sophisticated blind up. Um, just waiting for this guy to go because my wind deflectors are windows down, just below the wind deflectors, and he'll hear me when I start talking loud. So if he goes, yep, the cars don't matter just because he's rolling up and down, he'll hear us. So just hold fire and I'll show you what we're going to cook. At last, I thought he was never going to go. Okay, let's get back to business. So the light is fading fast, I'm having to put blinds up, I was wanting to try and do it without putting the blinds up, but I didn't expect it to be as busy. But anyway, it is what it is. Let's show you what we're going to make. Let's show you the ingredients. First of all, if I can lift up without spilling it everywhere. Oh. Look at this for a smorgasbord of stuff. Oh, we got that there. That's the best part of all. Doogie's goodies cake. So, I'll put the cake to the side for now. That'll be our dessert later on. And, so what have we got here? If I set it further back, can you see? Let's see. No, I'm just going to have to show you individually. So we've got some prawn crackers. And we've got, it's my favourite curry. Mayflower curry sauce mix. Powder. Usually I would put this through a seven Get lumps of it, but we're going to go hardcore lumps in all the day. Um, I make it with milk, butter, and um, then we've got the egg fried rice, obviously to have with it. Mushrooms, or chicken, of course. Nice big red pepper and onions. We have garlic granules, some black pepper, some bird's eye hot chili flakes, and of course, can't forget, a wee bit of soy sauce. So, let's get to work. I am starving.
Old chicken. Big Ronnie used to say. That smells good. Real good. Add the mushies. We add some milk. Well, need some more curry. Some garlic granules. The mushrooms give it that nice dark look. A few chili flakes. They are hot, so it doesn't take much of them. Just show you the curry sauce again, in case you want to try it. The good old Tesco's ready to eat hot or cold egg fried rice. I'm just thinking I maybe should have done the rice in the pot and do it with water but give it a little bit more of a steam but nah that's the word. We're committed. We're going down this road now today, we'll try this. Shovel like this overhand. You know what, guys? I completely forgot the whole point of this video. To tell you what the whole point of this video was, I got caught up with um, these guys coming and waiting for them to go and and getting the food on the go before the light faded. The whole point of this, it's a nice celebration meal for a chapter ending in my career and a new one starting. So what does that mean? What am I talking about? Well, once again, I'm changing jobs. <laughs> You'll not be surprised. So, today was my last official work day in the current employment. Um, come Monday, we start a complete new chapter in my working career. 
So I thought myself I'd come out a little lay by stealth after work, after my final shift, and cook myself a nice curry to celebrate the end and the beginning as well. Anyway, let's do a taste test and blabber on. Delicious, if I say so myself. It's missing one thing, but an avocado. Here, I've never tried these before. Be interesting to see if they're as good as the, the ones you get from the actual Chinese takeaway itself. Who else does this with their prawn crackers? Shovels inside it. They are good. They're like lighter, but like sort of melt in your mouth. See these plates? I don't. I hate these plates. They're so slidey. Slide all of them off my knees. It really bugs me. So I'll make a bit of a table here. And we'll do some munching beside the bin. You know how I roll. There we go, that's a hand shot. I can sort of peek out here and see it's going on as well. At the minute. We're all alone in here. At the minute. I can't see that being the case for too much longer, but so. I'm going to enjoy this. The way I always do, and I'll bring you back. polished. I feel a bit sick now because I uh, piled a lot more curry on top of it. Um, didn't want to go to waste. So I think I'm going to have to wait five minutes or so to uh, tackle a bit of this bad boy here. Would you like this? You will like it. I love this. It's my favourite cake. Doogie Scooties. What do they call it? Just a plain Plain iced layers. It's a like birthday cake, but the best birthday cake ever. The state of this place. So I'll have to do a bit of tidying first before you even think about plating that cake up. You know what, people? I am happy enough just lying here with the lights off, Netflix off. And just staring at this front window, watching cars fly up by, watching cars pull in, take off again. It's actually making me quite sleepy. <laughs> I could see myself falling asleep pretty soon. I was hoping the traffic would die down and I would be able to get out and have a bit of an explore, but we may have to just wait till the morning and do it. You know, just, what's this guy doing? Uh, I don't know if there's much to look at out there, uh, you know, uh, there's a, there is a bridge here somewhere. Uh, I don't know if it's up that side or it's bit, not all up behind the van, but I forget now. Uh, it goes over the over a river. I just want to go down and have a quick look at it and um, see if there was anywhere for a possible camp. You know, a tent camp obviously, or, or bivy or whatever, or possibly hammock, but... Okay folks, it's 10 o'clock. I think I'm going to, um, I'm just going to turn these lights off. I'm going to lie here, I'm going to leave the blind open, I'm just going to stare out this front window and just chill out and just drift off to sleep. And uh, just going to watch the world go by, just going to watch these cars go up and down here. Let's just turn these lights off now. Oh. Spin these round. I'll let you just sit and watch out there while I'm watching. Just watch the cars go up and down there, just wondering where they're going, who's in them, head. Families, people coming home from late shifts at work, evening shifts, some people going to work. Glory drivers go across the country. Boy racers out cruising. Just people living their lives, going about their business. And we're lying in the back here of our little stealth van. Loving life. There's nothing like it. I miss the van camp.
I love a good bottle comp. Anyway, folks, thanks for watching this far, and I will see you in the morning for a nice cup of coffee. And I will try and get some thumbnails in the morning. That should be interesting. We'll have a good We'll probably get a lot of horns beeping in the morning, but saying that tomorrow Saturday we'll be up early, so maybe they'll not be as busy the road tomorrow. Anyway, I'll see you in the morning, folks. Good night. Good morning, people. What time is it? Quarter to six. Right outside. So it's time to get up. Give me your look up, mate. Still looking at no visitors in here. A few cars came in and pulled in night last night, but nobody bothered us. I wouldn't be surprised if I get a, a visit from a, an old work colleague here this morning. He goes by this way to work. Um, he should be going along any minute now. But he may not have time to stop and turn and come back. But Okay, I think we'll head out the side door here on the other side so nobody sees us. This means a bit of manoeuvre night. Alright, let's get on the go and see what we can see. There's a bit of an island down there. But... I'm going to cross over. There's a little bling over there. There she is. Yeah, so there's like a, a bit of a walk down into this one here. There's no animals in here, so we can go on down and have a nosy. Gates open. Oh, jeez. No, that's a no go. No go. Nowhere to camp here, folks. Let's just. Oh, oh, uh, I thought it went better than this down here. I thought there would have been somewhere. I thought there would have been like some sort of platform or structure below this, but there's not. You can do a bit of a, a bevy bag, camp sort of here, sort of ever, but. This river is fished a lot, um, so you would get, for sure, you would get somebody down while you were here. Just, I just really thought there would have been a bit of like a ledge onto this bridge, but it's so hard to find a bridge with the ledge under the side. You know, just whenever you do find one, it's a slope. See me going in here.
Well, there you go. I think we'll we'll call it quits. That's enough. Don't want to drag the video on too long. So that was lay by number six, if I'm not mistaken. I'm not really sure it was six. If not, I'll put it on the screen. I was wrong. It wasn't six. Um, yeah. So we're going up on the bud. Going to go up the road. Get some clean clothes on. Get a good shower. And um, thanks very much for watching. Uh, if, if you want to do me a favour, comment, like. And if you haven't already, subscribe, share the video, do all the good stuff. You know, hit the notification bell. Yeah, I was looking at my analytics there, and I'm looking to see what videos are suggesting my videos. And YouTube has definitely given me the shaft. It's most randomest videos that people, if they're watching this random stuff, are never going to click onto my videos. I was like. A lot of them like these random like songs or even what they haven't heard in my life like and different languages and nothing stealth related camp uh, like stealth company related fan company related you know tents wild camp nothing like that it's all weird so we'll have a look in to see if we can sort that because that's definitely not doing many favors but do you also had to say for where I went I don't think so um just just keep watching guys and I'll just keep making them and um, that's the deal with that's the deal we've got I'm um, sort of my mind's out of a blank this morning it's too early it's just after six I had to have my coffee that's the problem I'm going back and get my coffee um, change my socks I'm soaking now and got the road and um, thanks very much for watching folks see you next one